Good morning, everybody, from a beautiful, wintry, packed, full New England base camp here on Saturday morning. Today, we are going to be doing some STEM activities and doing a STEM fundraising program. We've got special guests, special promotions, and showing you all the exciting stuff that's going to be happening here at New England Base Camp in 2022. And what an amazing year we've got planned here at Base Camp for everyone who wants to come and enjoy the program. Today, we got seven different Facebook Lives that we're going to be doing, including uh, guest speakers, for, including Eric Evans, who is the director of Lincoln Labs uh, here in Massachusetts. We have some guest scientists that are going to do it. We're going to share some experiments that our team has created and been doing for the past year or two years here at New England Base Camp that you could try at home or try at your scout meeting or your school group or anything else like that. But today... What we're going to start off by doing is we're going to go into here, the Egan Center, which is the main building here. We're going to visit with my friend Nick Kirpin, who is the weekend camp director, as well as one of the educators, and also helps out with a lot of the schools here in Boston. And he's going to show us a little fun experiment that we're going to do. And we'll take you over into the technology wing, and we're going to take a look at what is happening, what are some of the big things that are going to happen in 2022, and then we'll see you guys a little bit later. One thing, we are going to do a fundraiser, so when this video is over, we'll post it and we will put the link down there. If you're interested in supporting STEM programs uh, here at New England Base Camp and around the greater Boston area, uh, we'll give you the opportunity to donate to that. But I'm going to put my mask on and we're going to head on inside the Egan Center. All right. Put it on correct tank. Have on out so you can test it out. But let's come over here and say hi to my friend Nick. Good morning. Hey, Nick, what you got for us today? Oh, so to wake everyone up, just a simple green t-shirt. We have five things, two colors. You have to be touching both colors at once, and you can't twist them as moving. And your goal is to, as you're moving them, sort out the two different I colors. Give that a try on your own. All right, so what do you need to be able to do this? Ooh, you need to have creative thinking because the rules are very simple. But if you assume too much, you might think that you can't go backwards or you might not think you can do the moves that it takes to go because you're assuming rules that aren't there. So knowing the rules and knowing how to use them is an important part of creativity. Cool. Do you have another game that you can just show us? Actually, this one, very similar theme. All right, so we got three different colors this time. Three colors. Red, we can't touch it at all. Okay, no so touch. this one, no touch, this one, this no one, touchy touchy. Can't touch it, can't. This one, I can touch it, but I cannot move it. Okay. It's stationary, and green, go, I can touch and move. And all right. The challenge is to somehow get the green one between the blue and the red, and I can't just push it through there, because that's touching the red one by proxy, and the challenge is to figure out what to do. I'll give people a moment to think of solutions, that's not right, I can't do that because I'm not allowed to move it, but instead, Oh, easy enough. All right. Just a couple think, quick thinking games. So doing a little science to be able from, from uh, movement and being able from spatial recognition. So excellent. Very cool. All right, Nick, thank you very much. We'll see you again a little bit later. So we're moving into the technology wing today. And now I'm all by myself on this side of the building. So I'm going to take off my mask so you can see what is going on. One of the big things that are going to be happening here in 2022, here at New England Base Camp, is that we are making a space for makers. We want our participants, our edge schools and our groups coming here to make something. Now, it could be something as simple as like our Thursday STEM program that it has right here. And they've got a challenge. They're doing marble runs. So they're creating their marble runs using Legos. So it could be something as simple as that, uh, which will be done indoor here in the technology wing. Or it could be something a lot more. This is da, 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 da. one of the activities or one of the things that are going to be massive changes. This year, or actually at the end of last year, New England Base Camp received a $60,000 grant from the McGee Foundation. McGee Foundation is a foundation that is established to support scouts here in Massachusetts. If you ever go to a camp uh, around Massachusetts, you're going to see stuff that, that says McGee. Uh, some of our previous uh, awards that we've had is improvements on the cabins, uh, new campsites. In fact, if you come here and test out the McGee campsite, you'll be able to see it. But also, you'll see um, the new amphitheater is a McGee project for that. 
We are going to, to this year take our McGee Foundation that they've awarded us and create a maker space. Now, the building that's already existing, so you'll see this wonderful building right here, that is a Fuller Lodge. Fuller is named after a pair of brothers from Quincy who uh, were really great and came here and did volunteered and did a lot of work. We're conver converting that to have space around both sides of it. So it's going to be outdoor learning space. We're going to convert the inside where there's going to be woodworking, metalworking. Uh, there's going to be 3D printers. There's going to be tools, um, everything from creating your uh, sword from with using metalwork to fabricating uh, cosplay costumes to theater design. The outside, sp sp outside space is going to be covered with plastic so you could be able to see through it and also get some ventilation. Um, and all this design, everything, is that we're working with Wentworth Institute of Technology here in Boston in order to be able to come up with design and having students helping other students in that. Our goal is that this project is going to start very soon. The decks will be um, started very soon. And our goal is that this project is completed by summer. In order for scouts and participants in our camp program to come here to New England Base Camp and use our maker space for the first time. The space is going to be available on weekends for design as well as specialty classes. We are going to increase our number of programs that we're offering. Um, everything from... Um, computer design and programming and all the way up into more of the um, skill trades type aspect of it, like plumbing and, and welding and those type of those pro programs. That's one of the exciting things that are coming STEM-wise here at New England Base Camp in 2022. Today, every half hour, give or take a couple minutes, we will be doing the Facebook Live all the way up to about 2, 2.30, where we're going to announce some exciting news. A few of the things that you can see or learn about uh, today is that we're going to talk about some new program kits that are being launched. Today's the first official day. We got some exciting changes and new programs are being added to our STEM camp, our April vacation camp here at New England Base Camp. Um, we're going to take a look at our nature ecology section down there, which is everybody's favorite section, which we're going to visit with Jesse and Gizmo and Franklin and our newest addition to the team, which is Corilla, and talk a little bit about the animals and what's down there and why we have them, which is really important. And we're going to come back here. We're going to finish up the day here at the technology wing, which is we're going to talk about our robotics program. We're going to talk about our 3D printing program, our animation program, and things like that. So come back every half hour, um, or you can watch the videos afterwards. But everybody, welcome to New England Base Camp in 2022, and we look forward to seeing you. Have a great day.